Hi, I'm Joe. I'm one of the client relationship managers at Space, and today I'm going to talk through what are the main principles of Passive House. Passive houses have to follow five main principles. MVHR system, airtight construction, high quality insulation, no thermal bridging and superior glazing. So the first is an MVHR system, mechanical ventilation with heat recovery. It's a ventilation system that extracts the warm stale air from your wet room, such as your kitchens and your bathroom, extracts it out of the property. At the same time, fresh cold air from the outside is being drawn in and passes through an air to air heat exchanger, which captures the heat lost or the capture the heat in the stale air warms up the fresh air, which then gets filtered into habitable spaces such as your living rooms and your bedrooms. It's a way of retaining heat and improving air quality. The second principle is airtight construction. All passive houses have to achieve a maximum air change rate of 0 0.6. Uh, air change rates or an air leakage can account for up to 40% of heat loss through properties through gap gaps and cracks in the build envelope. Uh, so having a low air tightness is vital in having an energy efficient home, which is all about, which is all passive house, the principles are all about. Uh, so yeah, maximum air change rate 0 0.6. Third principle is a high quality insulation. Uh, that sort of does what it says in the tin. It uh, promotes a high, far higher quality insulation and more of it in the walls, floors and ceilings um, to retain that heat and improve the overall fabric efficiency of the property. This then combines with the fourth principle, which is thermal bridging free. Thermal bridging occurs when an element passes through another element and penetrates through it. And it can account for up to 30% heat loss, uh, fabric heat loss. So increasing the insulation, ensuring any penetrations, any junctions are highly insulated, uh, improve overall efficiency of the property. Um, and is a key, uh, it's one of the main principles and a key in producing passive houses. So the final principle is high quality superior glazing typically argon filled triple glazed windows designed in a way with the orientation to maximize solar gains for the winter months and minimize solar gains for the summer months to prevent overheating. Hopefully you found this informative. If you'd like to know any more information about passive houses, please check out the Knowledge Hub and don't forget to like and subscribe.